We look at our country and see so much that isn't working the way it should. Here in Nevada, a brave young girl told me how scared she is that her parents could be deported. In South Carolina, I met kids trying to learn in crumbling classrooms and neglected communities. And then there's Flint, Michigan, where children were poisoned by toxic water just because their governor wanted to save a little money. So Americans, Americans are right to be angry, but we're also hungry for real solutions. But if we listen to the voices of Flint and Ferguson, if we open our hearts to the families of coal country and Indian country, if we listen to the hopes and heartaches of hardworking people across America, it's clear there is so much more to be done. The truth is, we aren't a single issue country. Now, no one can get this done alone, not even the President of the United States. It's got to be the mission of our entire nation. I have never believed in dividing America between us and them. We are all in this together. We all have to do our part. I am on my way to Texas. I'm on my way to Texas. Bill is on his way to Colorado. The fight goes on. The future that we want is within our grasp. Thank you all. God bless you.